I'm Stuart Maxfield, and I'm composing all the music for the bridge with my brother Andrew. So we're making something that's, that to me feels really new and really explorative. It's this incredibly tense story about a guy who in northern Alabama during the Civil War gets tricked into trying to burn down a bridge. It's all about following an ideology too far. In looking for the right choreographer for this, we had to find someone who could tell a story in a way that left enough space for people to hear their own stories within the story that we're telling. Yeah, I want audiences to work a little bit so that they can sort of discover how they interpret the story. There's a bit of like a body language that you can pick up on. So I'm trying to strip down and really like drill into what's important and then use everything else to support that. One of my favorite parts about designing costumes is seeing it on the stage, seeing the dancers in this case perform and seeing them just really come to life. This was interesting. Uh, I've actually never done design for a, di a dance before. It's been really fun. And this has really been trying to create a world. You know, they need the space to be able to tell that story through their movement. The moment I look forward to in this whole process is uh, seeing everything come together, seeing the dancers on stage and how they move and how the set and them interact with each other and how when the lights turn on, everything seems to feel like we're in the world that we've been trying to create. The bridge is more than just a great show to come and see. It's an experience that you're going to have that you have to be there to see it and to feel what these dancers are portraying. It is the result of so much effort and I think that it will be a huge payoff for people who come.